Hey everyone, Ben here and welcome to Motivation to Invest. Artificial intelligence, machine learning, high performance computing, these are areas which are set to explode in the up and coming years, especially with the rollout of 5G. And there is one penny stock I've recently been researching which could be an extremely great play on this space. Now the stock has previously free xed since 2020, since I first covered it on this channel, but it has had a major pullback now, so it could be a potential buying opportunity. So before we hop right in guys, if you do appreciate valuable updates like this, stock analysis and deep dive investment research, then feel free to subscribe to this channel and join the investing family by hitting that subscribe button and turning that notification bell on. And remember guys, if you do wanna access all my buys, all my sales in real time, check out that second link in the description below for the VIP membership group, or even you can check out our ultimate investing strategy course. That's the first link in the description below. With that being said, let's dive in. Hopping right in here guys, the company is called One Stop System. So I previously covered this stock early in 2020. So if we go back here, the stock was just $2 per share, June 2020. So a true penny stock, it was around a dollar um, earlier on in the year. And I covered this stock, I actually did invest into this um, stock and it did run up, run up massively. So it actually went up by nearly 5x, so 493%. So incredible, incredible returns. But like many of these penny stocks, they're extremely volatile. So you do have to really trade them once they run up high. If they run up fast, you really have to take some profits and trim that position. So the stock has pulled back massively now and the stock is down around 37%. Now, personally, I've done a lot of research into this company. And for me, that real major drop is unjustified. I think this drop has really occurred because of a few factors I'm gonna mention later in this video, but mainly because of the major run-up. So really, it's just a pullback. So this could be a potential opportunity. Of course, guys, this is not financial advice, especially as this is a penny stock, high risk, high reward play. Please do your own due diligence research, diversify your portfolio. Don't put all your money into a crazy penny stock. It's still a lot safer than cryptocurrency. So market cap for this company, $100 million. The company is founded in 1998. So this is an established player in the space. And what I love about this company, so this company focuses on AI on the fly system. So artificial intelligence on the fly. So there's many different applications for this from autonomous vehicles to machine learning, to submarines, to aircraft, all over the world, there's many, many different applications. The company's customers currently include major defense contractors such as Raytheon, Talus, Boeing, and many, many more. So for such a tiny company, they have great connections and great relationships. And basically what this company does is allow these high performance computing applications where there's a lot of data which needs processing fast in real time, and it allows that to be processed at the actual edge, so at the product system, rather than in the cloud. Now, if that may sound confusing for you guys, you can basically think about this. That delay is vital in certain applications. This could be military applications. This could be an autonomous vehicle application. Let's say an autonomous vehicle is driving and a child steps out in front of the car. The car needs to process that information extremely fast and make a split second decision. And if it has to transport that information across, let's say a 5G network, or a right to the cloud and then come back with the actual result, then a couple second delay could actually be fatal for that child. So that is the real benefit with this company, the real advantage of this company, and why they're pursuing this space heavily. So the edge computing market was valued at $228 million in 2020, and is expected to reach a value of over $10 billion by 2026. That's a compound annual growth rate of 29%. So this market is growing incredibly, incredibly fast. So the company will create these products, AI on the fly service, AI on the fly storage, PCIe expansion. And basically what these devices are is basically the NVIDIA graphics cards, the NVIDIA process, the NVIDIA data center technology from that exceptional company combined with Micron flash storage. And what they basically do is combine them together in a customized package for their customers. So that is really the benefit of this company. But the company is also involved, surprisingly, in the media and entertainment space. So if you've ever seen these big 3D backdrops, especially at places like festivals or major television shows like American Idol, then most likely they would have used some sort of application from One Stop Systems. For example, Katy Perry on American Idol, they're really proud of this in their annual report 
use their system for a 3D backdrop on their show. And their system's also being used at the Super Bowl. Okay, so what's so special about this company right now? Well, this company could be an inflection point. So in 2020, of course, we had the global pandemic hit the world and many live media and entertainment events were shut down, including many large events such as the Super Bowl, American Idol, etc. This actually meant that many of One Stop Systems' customers were majorly affected, and that actually impacted the revenues of One Stop Systems massively and actually caused a slight decline in their revenues. Now, as that's only a temporary issue which happened in 2020, then this company could actually be poised to actually have a major rebound in 2021, 2022, and then moving forward into the future. So that's why this company is very interesting right now. Okay, so what about the management and the insiders of this company? Well, one thing I look for when investing into any business is insiders have a large holding in the company. And as I can see here, 24.9% of the shares are held by insiders. So to me, that says they have a lot of faith in the company. Now, there is one major risk which I picked up with this. So early in 2020, the CEO and founder of the company, so ideally, I do like founder-led companies, but the founder of the company actually had a major dispute with the company. So this guy here, um, Stefan Cooper, he had a major dispute with the company. And actually, he is actually in a lawsuit against the company. So, so I think that's another red flag, which has actually caused some potential volatility with this company. But he still owns around 16.44% of the company. And they now have a new CEO. So that's the only real issue I can see in the back of my mind, which makes me a little bit cautious on this stock. But apart from that, everything else seems great in terms of the tailwinds behind this company. Okay, what about those juicy financials? You've talked about all the fuzzy stuff, Ben, that we can't really touch and feel. What about those juicy financials? Well, let's hop in to my deep dive valuation model. So here we are, guys. As you can see, your revenue is around $51 million, down from $58 million in 2020, which, guys, most people don't know. That's just because the major media entertainment part of the business was actually shut down. So I wouldn't really call that a major negative effect on this individual business, but more a macro effect, which many people at Wall Street won't even realize. They'll just say, oh, the company's declining in revenue. They won't even dive deeper to actually see why that revenue actually declined. So to me, that doesn't bother me at all. The company's margins have been improving. The company's also issued some shares, which is bad, but I've actually took them into account in the valuation and they've raised $19 million in cash. So they've issued the shares for a good reason. They spend a hell of a lot on R&D. I've been really, really conservative with this company with its growth rates. So I predict 5% for next year, which is really, really insignificant growth rates and 10% for the next two to five years. So these are some of the most conservative estimates I've ever done on a stock. And if we hop into the valuation, the stock is undervalued right now. So for me, the value per share is $7.92 per share, and it's currently trading at $5 per share. So to me, the stock is around 30% undervalued right now, which does offer a margin of safety. Could definitely be a potential opportunity there. It is a penny stock, guys, so it will be high risk, high reward. It will be extremely volatile. But still, I think this is a great company if you're after a play in the small cap space. But I'd love to hear your thoughts, guys. What do you think of One Stop Systems? And do you like me to cover these penny stocks, these small cap stocks? They are high risk. They do. They are more volatile. But if you guys want me to cover them, I'm happy to continue to do so. If not, I'll keep them exclusively in the VIP group. Because really, small cap penny stocks are the only opportunity to actually make major 5x, 10x returns in the market because the big financial institutions, the big hedge funds can't even touch the small companies because they'd end up buying the whole company. And that is where us as retail investors could gain an investing edge. So I'd love to hear your thoughts, guys. Please do comment below. If you did find value in this video, feel free to give it a big thumbs up. It helps out tremendously with the channel. If you haven't joined the investing family yet, feel free by hitting that subscribe button, turning that notification bell on. And if you do want to step up your investing game or join our financial community, then feel free to check out that first link in the description below for our ultimate investing strategy course or our thriving VIP membership community. With that being said, thank you guys so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. I hope you all have an incredible day and I wish you well in the markets and I'll see you in my next video. Invest safe.